I reckon, mm. I reckon it'll get <laughs> better looking as the days go Hopefully. on. Now, Georgie, over the years, you may have known, has uh, had quite a close association with Oasis, Georgie, and they're, they're doing something very special at the moment. Yeah, they are, Lisa. Thank you very much for that. Every night, um, as we've discussed on this program before, thousands of young Australians have nowhere to sleep. And thanks to the Salvos, many do find shelter, they find care, and most importantly, they find hope. And now, just in time for Christmas, this is your opportunity to help their very important work, and a very famous face is back in Australia to tell us how. She's one of our most successful performers, selling nine million albums and topping charts across the globe. But taking time out from her latest album, Natalie Imbruglia, has come home. She's here to offer a helping hand to the 32,000 Aussie kids forced to sleep on the street. Everybody's got their own story. Everybody comes from a different home set up and it's an emotional issue and, and depending on the circumstances people have been through, anyone could end up in that situation. The Salvation Army is on the front line in the war against youth homelessness and it's through its Oasis Foundation that so many young lives are turned around. I mean, you know, you find yourself in a situation where you've just got nowhere to go. So places like Oasis where they can drop in at any time and have people that unconditionally make that choice to love them and listen to them and be there for them no matter what mood they're in that day, um, we all need that. Food, shelter and support are all available to those in need. But there's another crucial service this wonderful organisation offers. When did you write it? Um, like two, three weeks ago. Okay. The street media program is in all of our programs the area where young people can have a space to be able to work through the trauma in their life in a really creative way and to make sense of their past and to then really change the way they see the future through jewellery making, through music, through you know drama, through art and it's just a way to for them to you know to make a difference in their life and to bring some joy into them. Hard on the street because the life was bad and I don't want to look back to other stuff that I've done because I want to be better for my girl and my mom. I can't imagine being who I am without having the outlet of, of music and songwriting and, and acting and all the different things that I do. So uh, it really is important for these kids' rehabilitation and confidence to be able to express themselves uh, through the arts. But when I see you dance without me, all I need is your be. Singing for me is like opening my heart and I think that by singing about things that that I had gone through and sharing it with other people is really empowering. I didn't really believe in myself and the people that believed in me are Oasis and they had confidence in me and they offered me to be part of this program. When a financial crisis threatened the program, a very special partnership between Natalie and Kayla's jewellery swung in to help creating a range just to support Oasis. The funding for this room was actually stopping uh, at a certain point next year, so the sales from this jewellery is going to keep this room running. How does it make you feel? <laughs> um, it makes me feel like my life has a purpose. It's a bit like giving you wings to fly. Yes, it is, yes. And that makes you happy, doesn't it? Yes. <laughs> I cannot tell you what beautiful, inspiring young people they are and they really need our help and our compassion. If you want more information on the life-changing work of the Oasis Foundation, I would really urge you to visit the salvos.org.au forward slash oasis and you're looking here at some of the jewellery um, with this arrangement between Natalie and Kalis. That's a beautiful bracelet. The necklace I'm wearing is one of them as well. What a beautiful Christmas present to give someone, Carl and Lisa, and yeah. know that a part of that is going towards Oasis. Beautiful. All the details on our website. Beautiful. Thing. Is that one yeah. around your neck too? It is I've, indeed. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. It's That's a beautiful gorgeous. collection. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Great thing to do. Yeah, terrific stuff. Mm. That's uh, given me a terrific idea. <laughs> Cass is all there sorted. There you go. <laughs> Easy. Oh, was it me? Am I all sorted? Well, I wasn't. No. I wasn't. You know, I got you those little oil thingies, that candles I loved, last time, that you, and you that just I said to me the other day you don't like no, them. No, no, no. So don't stop. go back there. Anyway. That's not true. <laughs> well,